여러분 안녕하십니까? Hello everyone. 어, 성경은 신기한 것이 예수님인데요. The amazing thing about the Bible is Jesus. 어, 예수님을 만나면 사람들이 변합니다. When people meet Jesus, they change. 사람 마음에 포도주도 변, 물도 포도주로 변하고요. Not only do people change, but even water changed. It changed into wine. 그 해당장 야이로의 딸이 죽었는 예수님 만나면 살아나기 시작했고. And Jairus's daughter, she was dead, but through meeting Jesus, she came alive. 문둔병자가 깨끗하게 낫고. A leper becomes completely healed. 가난한 여자가 죄 사함을 받고. The woman taken into adultery receives the forgiveness of sins. 중풍병자 일어나 걷고. The paralytic is able to arise and walk. 정말 그저 죄인들이 어렵다 함을 얻고 and really sinners become righteous. 예수님이 하시는 그런 일입니다. Such are the things that Jesus does. 저는 오랫동안 교회를 다녔지만 I went to church for a long time. 늘 죄인인 상태에서 다니며 교회 신앙생활을 했습니다. But in the state of a sinner, I went to church and lived spiritual life. 그런데 예수님을 믿으면서 이제 점점 내 속에 회의가 커졌고 But as I continue to believe in Jesus, I began to be more and more regretful. 그리고 내 마음의 고통이 커졌습니다. And the pain rather grew greater in my heart. 내가 1962년도 그, 그 해는 내 인생한테 가장 어렵고 힘든 세계, 시간이었습니다. And 1962 was the most difficult, painful year of my life. 뭘 하려고 발버둥쳐 된게 아무것도 없었고. You know, I tried so hard to do something, but everything failed. 모든 게 실패로 끝났어. And all that I did ended in failure. 소망이 없었습니다. I had no hope. 한 나에게 밝은 아침을 주시게 어두운 밤을 주신 것처럼 no, God had given me the bright morning but it felt as though he gave me the dark night. 죄 때문에 고통했고 I was in pain because of sin. 주님 오실까 봐 두려웠고 and as I was afraid that the Lord might return. 난 죽으면 지옥 가는 걸 정확하게 알았어. And I knew for sure that if I died I would go to hell. 그러면서 이제 내가 나를 믿는 내 의지 이런 것들이 아무 소용이 없었습니다. And then my own will to believe and all of these things were so useless. Useless. I tried so hard not to lie. It didn't work. Whenever I opened my mouth, it was always lies. And I always was so determined that I grit my teeth to not steal. But whenever I was with my friends, I was always out stealing. And that was the kind of life I lived. And even though I was diligently going to church, however, the church could not give any kind of change to my faith, to my spiritual life. And I know very well that through our efforts, overcoming sin, and through our efforts, it's impossible to overcome sin and temptation. And I always lost to the temptations and I always fell into sin. But in October 1962, according to those words in Romans. For all have sinned and come short of the glory of God. But through the redemption that is in Christ Jesus. It says being justified freely by His grace through the redemption that is in Christ Jesus. And also before that in Romans it says, And now a righteousness of God without the law is manifested. Before I tried to keep the law and try to not sin to become righteous. But it showed a path to become righteous without the law. A righteousness of God without the law was manifested. That which is by faith. Upon all them that believe in Jesus Christ. For there is no difference. And as I was reading that in the Bible, 
And then in Romans chapter 3, verse 26, it talks about how God is righteous and He has also made us righteous. God wants to make us righteous. If God, even though He is the righteous judge, there are some people who say, yeah, we're sinners, but God has just called us righteous, called us justified. Everyone, that is a person who does not know the Bible at all. God can never call a sinner righteous. If God just calls a sinner righteous, then God would not be a righteous judge. God would be a sinner too. And God as a righteous judge can never call a sinner Righteous. Uh, many people say, yeah, we're sinners, but God just calls us righteous. But if God, we who are sinners, called us just righteous, then God would not be a righteous judge. God was righteous to begin with. And if that righteous God calls us sinners righteous, it would break God's righteousness and God would become a sinner too. You know, if a judge says, oh, I know him, and calls a criminal not guilty, then that judge is an unworthy judge. If God calls us sinners righteous, then as a judge, God would be unworthy. God could never say that a sinner is righteous. But God did call us righteous. Yeah, That's right. God says that we're righteous. We're sinners, but God says we're righteous, doesn't He? Oh, I'm sorry. Not so. God is not calling us righteous even though we're sinners. But because our sins have been forgiven through the blood of Jesus at the cross, He has called us righteous upon seeing that our sins have been forgiven. For all have sinned and come short of the glory of God. Being justified freely by His grace through the redemption that is in Christ Jesus. Because as Jesus was crucified, he died for us. Right then, all of our sins were cleansed. Therefore, in God's eyes, in our own eyes, we may look like sinners. But when God looks through His eyes, we were not sinners. We have been made righteous. We have been sanctified. Why? Because Jesus shed His blood. And through that blood, we have been washed clean. Therefore, when God sees us, He does not call us righteous even though we're sinners. Because we have been made righteous, that's why He says we're righteous. Amen, hallelujah. Amen, hallelujah. Therefore, what does it say here in the Bible? In Romans chapter 3, verse 26. To declare, I say at this time, his righteousness, that he might be just and the justifier of him which believeth in Jesus. Where is boasting then? It is excluded. By what law? Of works? Nay, but by the law of faith. Therefore, we conclude that a man is justified by faith without the deeds of the law. We are justified because we kept the law well. That is not how we were made righteous. 
the cross of Jesus. 우리 죄를 대신 십자 못 박혀 우리 죄가 씻어진 걸 믿는 겁니다. It is believing that He took the place of our sins and was crucified for our sins. 십자 못 박혀 죽으실 때, when Jesus was crucified and when He died, 예수 우리의 모든 죄의 형벌을 다 받으셨기 때문에. Because Jesus received the punishment for all of our sins. 하나님 보여도 죄를 지은 건 사실이지만, in God's eyes it is true that we have sinned. 예수의 피로 그 죄가 씻어졌기 때문에. But because those sins have been washed clean by the blood of Jesus. 우리를 의롭다고 하십니다. Therefore he says we are righteous. 만일에 우리가 죄가 있는데 의롭다고 하신다면 If God says we are righteous even though we have sinned 하나님은 고의로운 재판장이 아니기 때문에 Then that would make God an unrighteous judge. 하나님의 의가 깨어지는 겁니다. It would break God's righteousness. 물론 하나님의 의가 깨어질 수 없겠지만 But of course God's righteousness can't be broken. 분명히 하나님은 그 아들 예수님 보내서 But surely God sent his son Jesus 십자가에서 우리 모든 죄를 사하셨습니다. And he forgave all of our sins at the cross. 하나님 보실 때에 의롭게 보였습니다. And therefore we are righteous in God's eyes. 그날에는 우리를 의롭다고 한 것입니다. Therefore God says we are righteous. 우리가 죄인인데 의로운 게 아니고. He's not saying we're righteous even though we're sinners. 우리가 죄가 씻어졌기 때문에 의롭다고 합니다. He's saying we're righteous because our sins have been washed away. 우리는 어떻게 해서 말합니까? And what does it say? 우리 죄를 지은 건 사실이기 때문에. Yes, it's true that we have sinned. 나는 죄인이라고 말했습니다. People, I used to say I'm a sinner. 내가 죄를 지은 난 죄인이 맞습니다. Yes, I've sinned. I'm a sinner. 그런데 예수님 십자가에 못 박히시면서. But through Jesus being crucified. 내가 다 씻었기 때문에. He washed away all my sins. 내가 내 자신은 죄인이고. In my eyes, I'm a sinner. 예수님 십자가를 바라보며. But when you look to the cross of Jesus, 내 죄가 다 씻어진 것입니다. My sins have all been cleansed. 어인이 된 겁니다. You are righteous. 거룩한 것입니다. You are holy. 온전한 겁니다. You are perfect. 왜? Why? 예수님 피로 그렇게 된 겁니다. That's what has been done through the blood of Jesus. 여러분 얼마나 놀라운 사실. How amazing this is! 하나님이 놀랍게 그렇게 씻으신 것이. You know, God has amazingly washed us clean. 그래서 여러분 하나님 우리를 보고 의롭다고 하실 때. And that's why when God says that we are righteous. 우리가 죄인인데 의롭다는 게 아니고. He's not saying we are righteous even though we're sinners. 우리 죄를 죄인인데. Even though we're sinners who sin. 예수 십자가의 피가. But the blood of Jesus. 우리의 눈처럼 이게 씻었기 때문에. Because it washed away our sins as white as snow. 우리 의롭게 놓은 것입니다. He has made us righteous. 하나님 죄인인데 의롭게 보인 게 아니고. We don't just Look righteous, even though we're sinners. That's not what it is. No, we are wrong. We committed sin. We're sinners. But Jesus was crucified on the cross, and through that blood, our sins were forgiven. But we hold in our hearts the fact that we have sinned. But we don't have the cross of Jesus in our hearts. That the blood of the cross, it forgave all of my sins. If so, it's True, we are clean, we are righteous. But because people don't know this, you know, even though Jesus died on the cross for their sins, still people think of themselves to be sinners. That is the problem. If Jesus died on the cross, but if we remained sinners, then the cross of Jesus is nothing but a cross of failure. Then you would be belittling Jesus. The cross of Jesus did not fail. It washed away all of our sins whiter than the snow. We have sinned. And if Jesus died on the cross for my sins, then it's so clear, so definite, my sins have been washed. It is so clear. But people just remember the guilt of their sins. And people don't think Think of the power of the cross that died for you. Oh, I've lied. Oh, I stole. Oh, I'm a sinner. Oh, that's what people say. The woman taken in the act of adultery. Yes, she committed adultery. But Jesus says, neither do I condemn thee. You know why doesn't he condemn her? Because I'm going to die on the cross and wash away your sins. That's why. In the eternal realm, there is no time difference. But we are in the realm of time. And so it feels that way. Jesus died 2,000 years ago. He paid all the price of our sins. Therefore, it is so clear our sins have been washed away. However, Satan, Satan so subtly deceives you. When you say, I've committed murder, theft, adultery. 
사람이나 그 가족들의 양심의 가책을 받는. And you feel guilty in your conscience about the sin you've committed and the people you've hurt. 내가 도둑질해 내 피해를 입은 사람들께 내 가책을 받는 겁니다. You feel guilty about the people you hurt through stealing. 그다음에 그 마음에 자꾸 죄인이라는 의식이 있는 건 사실입니다. And then you continually feel conscious as if you're a sinner. 그러나 냉정하게 생각해 보면은. However, when you think about this objectively, yes, it is true. You have guilt and you have sin. But through Jesus dying on the cross, He has washed away all of your sins perfectly. That's why the story of the woman of adultery in John 8, Jesus does not only say that He does not condemn the woman taking adultery, but He is saying He does not condemn all of us. Let's find another place in the Bible. Romans chapter 8. 31절에 in verse 31 30절부터 읽겠습니다. We'll read from verse 30. 또 미리 정하신 그들을 또한 부르시고 부르신 그들을 또한 어렵다 하시고 어렵다 하신 그들 또한 영화롭다 깨 하셨느니라. Moreover, whom he did predestinate, them he also called, and whom he called, them he also justified, and whom he justified, them he also glorified. 미리 정하신 사람 부르시고 he called those who were predestinated. 부르신 그들을 어이롭다고 하셨고 and whom he called them he also justified. 어이롭다 하신 것도 영화롭게 했어요. and whom he justified them he also glorified. 31절 verse 31. 그런 적이 이래라 우리가 무슨 말을 하리요? what shall we then say to these things? 만일 하늘 우리가 누가 우리를 대적하리요? if God be for us who can be against us? 자기 아들을 아끼지 않아 우리 모든 사람 내가 주시니가 어찌 아들과 함께 모든 우리 은사를 주지 않으시는 He that spared not his own son but delivered him up for us all how shall he not with him also freely give us all things 33절을 보겠습니다 Let us look at verse 33 누가 능히 하나님 택하신 자들을 송사하리요 어렵다 하시는 하나님이시 Who shall lay anything to the charge of God's elect it is God that justifies 아무도 우리 송사할 수 없다고 There is no one who can charge us why? It is God that justified us. Let us look at verse 34. Who is he that condemneth? It is Christ that died, yea, rather that is risen again. Who is even at the right hand of God, who also maketh intercession for us. Amazingly, the blood of Jesus at the cross. It is clear proof that our sins are forgiven. And when at times you may feel guilty about your sins. But the precise thing is whether you feel guilty or not. Jesus was crucified for our sins. Therefore, when he told woman of adultery, neither do I condemn thee. Already Jesus bore all her sins. And because he was going to die for her on the cross, that's why he was able to say that. And before he said that, before he died for on the cross, and he says that to us now, after he has died on the cross, and the the problem is Jesus speaks from the eternal realm. But we speak in the realm of time. So you may feel difference. In the realm of time, there's a clear difference between the past and the future. But in the realm of the realm of eternity, there is no past, no future, only the present. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus has forever perfected and sanctified us. I came to know this truth in 1962. Even though I went to church, even though I said Jesus died for my sins, I still remained in the state of a sinner. In October 1962, right then the amazing thing was, it was not that I changed. It's not that I became more good. And it's not that I went 
and forgive my sins. 이미 예수 내 죄를 사해 놓으셨는데 already Jesus had forgiven my sins. 그때까지 난 죄인이라고 했습니다. But to that point I said I was a sinner. 그걸 잘 몰라서 그랬어. It was because I didn't know this. 그 뒤에 내가 성경을 다시 보니까 But afterwards when I read the Bible 내 죄를 죽으셨고 Jesus died for my sins. 놀라운 하나님 나를 의롭다고 하셨어. And amazingly God said I am righteous. 내 죄를 기억지 않는다. God says to me he remembers my sins no more. 그때 저는 찬송을 많이 했어. At that time, I sang the hymns so much. After my sins were forgiven, I came to know Jesus. Everything of me has changed. Now I step on the pathway to heaven. The blood of the Lord has forgiven my sin. Everything of me has changed. And I am redeemed by His blood. The Lord, He is my salvation. And there is no condemnation for me. And with those songs, the the spring of joy came in my heart. Before, even though I said Jesus died on the cross, even though I said He died for my sins, I was always a sinner. But that day, the moment I got to believe this, all the sins in my heart disappeared. And I became righteous. I became holy. From then on, there was the eternal redemption of Jesus in me. And I could not fall into darkness. He could not condemn me. And just like Romans chapter 8 says, I was able to accept in my heart the amazing fact that I had been perfected. And from then on, I read the Bible. And the Bible was filled with the amazing words of God that said all my sins were forgiven. Even though I read the Bible, I didn't know that. I only knew it in theory. And those words did not reach my heart. But, but from that day on, it changed. Jesus came inside of me. The most important thing is, He freed my soul from sin. And no matter where I looked, I was no longer a sinner. And before, if you sin, you're a sinner. And if you live as a good person, you're a good person. But the blood of the cross made me righteous even though I had committed sin. It, it cleansed me. 읽으면 읽을수록 the more I read the Bible, 저희 허물과 저희 죄를 내가 다시 기억지 않아야 돼. Their sins and iniquities will I remember no more. 이것을 사셨으니 다시 죄를 위해 제사 드릴 것이다. Where the remission of these is, there is no more offering for sin. 이런 말씀 너무 너무 새롭게 보여. And these words were so refreshing to me. 이사야 44장 22절에 Isaiah 44 verse 22. 내가 내 허물을 빽빽한 구름에 사라진 같이. For I have blotted out your transgressions like the thick clouds. 내 죄를 안개에 사라진 같이. And I have Blotted out your sins like the clouds. Return unto me, for I have redeemed thee. For I have redeemed thee. It was so amazing. I rejoiced. And I was thankful. Why? It wasn't somebody else telling me this. But Jesus said that I'm righteous. And God said that I'm righteous. Then that's right, I'm righteous. That's right, I am holy. Before I had so much of my own thoughts, and before it was my own thoughts that influenced me so much, but I'm no longer influenced by my thoughts, but influenced by the word of God. No matter how much I look like a sinner in my eyes, and even though I'm a person who may have committed many sins, if God says I'm righteous, I am righteous. God says I'm holy, I am holy. And that is what God was clearly saying to me. And I am so happy because in front of many, many people, I am testifying that the blood of Jesus forgave all my sins. 
행복하게 해줍니다. And that has so amazingly made me so happy. 이제 세월이 많이 흘렀습니다. Now a lot of time has passed. 나이도 늙었습니다. I am old in age now. 언제 죽을는지 모르지만. And I don't know when I'll die. 언제 어디 죽어도. No matter when or where I die. 하늘 나라에 소망을 가지고 있습니다. I have hope in heaven. 내삶 속에 예수님이 살아셔서. And Jesus is alive in my life. 내 앞에 길을 여시고. And opens the way before me. 살아서 일하는 걸 봅니다. And I see him living and working. 그때부터 and from then on, 많은 사람들에게 to many many people, 또 교회 다니는 사람들 and also to the people who go to church, 또 목회자에게 and also to pastors. 이야기를 하는 동안에 and as I speak to them, 너무 너무 감사한 삶을 살고 I'm able to live a very very thankful life. 많은 분들이 제 삶을 받았다는 것 성경에서 확인하고 and many people are able to see from the Bible that they have received the forgiveness of sins. 저는 자기 감정이나 자기 생각을 믿었는데 before they believe their own emotions and their own thoughts. 사람들이 하나 하나님을 믿는 믿음의 세계로 왔습니다. But these people came to the world of the faith to believe in God. 하나님 믿는 사람 하나님 말씀을 믿는 걸 가지고. And people who believe in God are the people who believe in the word of God. 다시 이야기하지만. In other words, 예수님이 나를 보고 어렵다면 의로운 거. If Jesus says that you are righteous, you are righteous. 하나님 나를 정죄하지 않는 정죄하지. If God says He does not condemn you, He does not condemn you. 너무 좋은 말씀들. And these are such wonderful words. 전에 눈이 가려 안 보였는데. Before I was blinded and I didn't know. 성경 읽을 때마다. But whenever I would read the Bible. 그 말씀 내 마음 안에 들어와서. Those words would enter into my heart. 새로운 힘을 주. And would give me new strength. 단에 설 때마다. And whenever I stand on the podium. 그 말씀을 증거해서. I testify those words. 내 죄가 사해졌다는 걸 이야기합니다. And I'm able to say my sins are forgiven. 여러분 모두의 죄도 그렇습니다. And this is true with all of your sins too. 우리 죄를 씻기는 What can wash our sins? 예수의 피밖에 다른 거 아무것도 없어요. Is nothing but the blood of Jesus. Nothing else at all. 예수의 피로 By the blood of Jesus Christ. 내 죄가 사한 것은 The fact that your sins are forgiven. 마음에 믿어 드는 것이. I believe that in your heart. 이제 크고 작은 많은 분들이 Now many people, big and small, 그 말씀 앞에 나와서 They have come before these words. 제 사함을 받습니다. And they receive the forgiveness of sins. 그들이 달라지는 걸 봐. And I see them changing. 우리가 할수 있는 것은 And the thing that we can do is 아무것도 없습니다. And there's nothing at all. 죄를 사하는 우리 힘으로는 절대 안 됩니다. And with our own strength, we can never forgive sins. 그래서 예수님이 하셨습니다. That is why Jesus did it. 예수님이 우리 죄를 위해 십자가에 못 박혀 죽으셨다가 Jesus died on the cross for our sins. 부활 하셨을 때 And when he resurrected, that's when all our sins were forgiven. And Jesus told the woman of adultery, neither do I condemn thee. And he's saying that to all of us also. 사랑하는 여러분, our loving folks, now throw away your thoughts and accept the words of Jesus into your heart. And if Jesus Christ lives and works inside of you, then you will change into amazing people. It will not be your sins in your heart. But I hope that the words of Jesus that has delivered you from sin will be alive in your heart. And those words will change your life. And I believe he will lead you to power and grace. 이제 제삼 받은 사람들끼리 같이 주님을 섬겨 사는 게 너무 행복했고. And I was so happy to be with other people who received the freedom of sins and served the Lord together. 우리 도야 하나님 역사한 역사가 너무 놀라웠어요. And it was so amazing the works of God He worked through us. 그러나 내가 이 말씀은 여러분 모두에게 임하게 되길 바랍니다. And I hope that this grace will be upon all of you also. 예수의 피로 제삼을 받았습니다. You have received the forgiveness of sins by the blood of Jesus. I hope that you will believe it. Thank you.